precision shooters, if you're ready to hit targets like never before, this video is for you. Today we're tackling one of the most crucial choices in long-range shooting, the best cartridges that can elevate your accuracy to the next level. With so many calibers out there, finding the perfect one can be a challenge, but this lineup has been hand-picked for their performance and reliability in the long-distance game. We'll go over the top cartridges trusted by experts for hitting those extreme ranges, breaking down exactly why these rounds are worth every shot. From record-breaking accuracy to unparalleled stability, these cartridges deliver where it counts. So if you're aiming to refine your setup and push your rifle further, you're about to find the best options to get the job done. And hey, if you're as excited as I am about precision shooting, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more tips and recommendations. Now let's see which cartridges make the cut. Let's start with a true standout in the world of long-range shooting, the 6mm Dasher. This cartridge has really earned its reputation among precision shooters, and there's a good reason for that. The 6mm Dasher is essentially a neck-down variant of the 6mm BR, designed to maximize efficiency, accuracy, and consistency, all qualities you want in a long-range round. The Dasher's unique design, with a sharper 40-degree shoulder and a bit of a shorter case body, allows it to burn powder more efficiently. This means you get excellent muzzle velocities, typically in the range of 2,800 to 2,950 feet per second, depending on your load and barrel length, which translates to flatter trajectories and more predictable ballistics at longer distances. And when you're aiming out past 1,000 yards, that predictability is everything. I've found the Dasher performs remarkably well in wind, too, which is often one of the biggest challenges in long-range shooting. It doesn't get pushed around as much as some of the other smaller 6mm cartridges, and it retains velocity exceptionally well. Now, one of the reasons the Dasher is so popular in competition is its consistency shot to shot. The efficiency of the case design and the powder burn rate contribute to extremely low standard deviations in velocity, which is key when you're looking for tight groupings at extended ranges. In my experience, once you dial in the load, the Dasher can achieve remarkable accuracy. And because it's a relatively mild cartridge in terms of recoil, you can stay on target easier and spot your own shots, a big advantage in both competition and practical long-range scenarios. The 6mm Dasher may take a bit more effort in terms of reloading, and it's not as readily available off the shelf as some other cartridges. But for anyone serious about precision shooting, this cartridge is absolutely worth the investment. It's a cartridge that's been proven time and time again on the competition circuit, and it offers that perfect blend of speed, stability, and low recoil. Moving on to the 6mm GT, another powerhouse in long-range shooting that has really gained traction in recent years. Created by George Gardner and Tom Jacobs, hence the GT, this cartridge was designed to address some of the common issues shooters encounter with other 6mm rounds. The 6mm GT balances speed, accuracy, and barrel life, making it an ideal choice for both competitive shooters and precision enthusiasts like myself. One of the things I love about the 6mm GT is its efficiency. It sits right in that sweet spot where it delivers great muzzle velocity, typically around 2,900 feet per second, without excessive powder consumption. This means less wear on your barrel, which is something I can always appreciate, especially if I'm planning to put in a lot of range time. The cartridge has a 35-degree shoulder angle which is optimized for feeding smoothly in a variety of actions, especially in magazine-fed rifles. I've had nothing but positive experiences with how reliably it cycles, even during fast-paced shooting sessions and matches. Now let's talk about wind performance, which is one of the reasons this cartridge has become such a favorite. The 6mm GT's high ballistic coefficient bullets really shine at keeping a stable trajectory even when conditions aren't perfect. In my experience, it handles crosswinds better than many other 6mm options, allowing me to maintain consistent accuracy 
out to 1,000 yards and beyond. For anyone shooting in windy environments, this cartridge is an absolute game changer. The 6mm GT is also popular for its low recoil, which allows for better follow-up shots and helps me stay on target, spot impacts, and make any necessary adjustments right away. It's a major advantage in competitive shooting, where speed and accuracy are equally important. If you're considering the 6mm GT, know that it's a bit of a newer cartridge, so factory ammo may not be as widely available as with some other calibers. But if you're open to reloading or sourcing from specialty shops, this cartridge is worth every bit of extra effort. For me, the 6mm GT combines everything you could want in a long-range cartridge – precision, efficiency, and reliability. It's one of those rounds that feels like it was made with serious shooters in mind, and it's become a go-to in my arsenal. Next up, we've got the 7mm PRC Wheeler, a cartridge that I consider a heavy hitter in the world of long-range shooting. The 7mm PRC was designed with extended range performance in mind, and it's quickly become a favorite for anyone looking to push their limits. It combines power and precision in a way that very few cartridges can, making it an ideal choice if you're aiming for those extreme distances with accuracy. One of the main reasons I'm such a fan of the 7mm PRC Wheeler is its ballistic performance. This cartridge is built to handle high ballistic coefficient bullets that can maintain stability and speed over extremely long distances. I've seen it deliver impressive energy retention and flat trajectories, which makes hitting targets at 1,500 yards and beyond much more manageable. For shooters who love stretching it out past typical long-range distances, the 7mm PRC Wheeler offers that added punch without a steep learning curve. In terms of muzzle velocity, the 7mm PRC consistently performs in the range of 2,850 to 3,000 feet per second, depending on the load. It gives you that perfect balance between speed and energy, and the extra velocity doesn't come at the cost of harsh recoil. In fact, I find the recoil quite manageable for a high power round, which allows for better control and quicker follow-up shots. When I'm dialing in for a long-range targets, the 7mm PRC's smooth recoil profile makes it easier to spot my impacts and make adjustments on the fly. One thing to consider is that the 7mm PRC Wheeler, while powerful, requires a bit more planning in terms of setup. This isn't necessarily a beginner-friendly cartridge, and I recommend pairing it with a strong, high-quality optic that can handle the extended ranges this round can achieve. If you're willing to invest a bit more in your setup, this cartridge can truly shine. For anyone serious about long-range shooting and looking for a round that can handle extreme distances with ease, the 7mm PRC Wheeler is hard to beat. It's a cartridge that delivers the energy, precision, and reach needed to make those challenging shots, and it has quickly become one of my go-to choices when I want to push my limits out there. Now let's talk about the 28 Sherman Magnum, a cartridge that has gained a lot of respect among long-range shooters and hunters alike. The 28 Sherman Magnum is all about power and precision, combining the best of both worlds in a way that few cartridges manage to achieve. When I'm looking to take on longer ranges with serious impact, this cartridge is one of my top choices. One of the things I really appreciate about the 28 Sherman Magnum is its design which optimizes both speed and stability at long distances. This cartridge is built to handle high BC 7mm bullets with ease, and it does an excellent job at retaining velocity. Out of the muzzle, you're looking at speeds in the ballpark of 3,000 feet per second, which is a serious advantage when you're trying to stay on target in variable conditions. That speed translates into a flat trajectory and makes it easier to compensate for wind drift which is something every long-range shooter values. On the range, the 28 Sherman Magnum performs beautifully. The recoil is noticeable, but it's surprisingly manageable for the power it delivers. In my experience, the extra energy is worth it, especially if you're planning to use this cartridge for hunting or competition shooting. 
It provides enough stopping power for larger game, which makes it versatile for both precision shooting and practical applications in the field. For those who want a dual-purpose round that's capable in both long-range target shooting and hunting, the 28 Sherman Magnum fits the bill. Last, but definitely not least, we have the 7mm Remington Magnum, a classic in the long-range shooting world and a personal favorite of mine. This cartridge has been around for decades and has stood the test of time, earning its reputation as one of the most versatile and reliable long-range rounds out there. The 7mm Rem Mag offers an incredible balance of power, speed, and accuracy, which is why you'll find it used in everything from precision shooting to big game hunting. One of the things I love about the 7mm Rem Mag is its ability to handle a variety of bullet weights, typically ranging from 140 to 175 grains. This flexibility allows you to customize your setup depending on your needs. For example, lighter bullets provide flatter trajectories and faster speeds, while heavier bullets deliver deeper penetration and more stability in windy conditions. When I'm at the range, I appreciate how easy it is to fine-tune this cartridge for different shooting conditions, and it performs remarkably well at distances out to 1,000 yards and beyond. In terms of muzzle velocity, the 7mm Rem Mag is no slouch, you can expect speeds between 2,800 and 3,100 feet per second, depending on your load, which provides a flat trajectory and helps minimize wind drift. This speed, combined with its high ballistic coefficient, allows it to retain energy and maintain accuracy at extended ranges. I found it especially useful in windy environments where other rounds can struggle to stay on track. One of the reasons the 7mm Rem Mag is so popular is its manageable recoil. While it packs a punch, it's not excessive, allowing you to stay on target more easily and make faster follow-up shots. In my experience, it's powerful enough for big game hunting, but also precise enough for competitive shooting. If you're looking for a versatile, proven cartridge that can handle long distances with ease, the 7mm Remington Magnum is a fantastic choice. It's reliable, widely available, and has a strong track record of performance in both tactical and hunting settings. For me, it's a go-to when I want a round that's equally suited to hitting distant targets or bringing down large games. Rounding out our list is the 6mm BR, or Bench Rest a legendary cartridge that's practically synonymous with precision shooting. This cartridge has been a staple among long-range shooters and competition enthusiasts for years, and for good reason. It's all about consistency, accuracy, and low recoil. When I'm looking to shoot small groups at long distances, the 6mm BR is one of my top choices. What makes the 6mm BR so special is its efficiency. The cartridge design has a short, fat case with a sharp shoulder angle, which promotes consistent powder burn and stable velocities. In practical terms, this translates to very low standard deviation in velocity, meaning that each shot is incredibly predictable. As any precision shooter will tell you, consistency is key, especially when you're trying to hit targets out past 1,000 yards. The 6mm BR delivers that consistency in spades. On the range, the 6mm BR is a joy to shoot. The recoil is minimal, which is a huge advantage for staying on target and spotting your own shots. I've found that even in windy conditions, the 6mm BR holds up well, thanks to the high ballistic coefficient of the bullets typically used with this round. It's a forgiving cartridge that handles wind better than many other rounds in its class, allowing for more accurate shots with less adjustment. One thing to keep in mind with the 6mm BR is that, while it's incredibly accurate, it does require some setup. This cartridge is widely favored by handloaders who like to tweak their loads for maximum precision, and factory ammo can be limited. However, if you're willing to reload, the 6mm BR is highly rewarding, allowing you to fine-tune each load to get the best performance possible. Overall, the 6mm BR remains one of the best cartridges for long-range precision shooting. 
It's a consistent low recoil option that excels in competition settings and is highly respected in the precision shooting community. If you're serious about accuracy and don't mind putting in some extra work at the reloading bench, the 6mm BR is a cartridge that will deliver shot after shot. And there you have it, our top picks for the best cartridges in long range shooting. Each of these cartridges brings something unique to the table, whether it's the precision and consistency of the 6mm BR, the powerhouse performance of the 7mm PRC Wheeler, or the versatility of the 7mm Remington Magnum. These rounds aren't just about hitting targets, they're about pushing the boundaries of accuracy, stability, and performance. Choosing the right cartridge can make a huge difference in your shooting experience, and hopefully, this list has helped you get a clearer picture of which one might suit your needs best. Whether you're dialing in for a competition, setting up for big game hunting, or simply aiming to improve your skills at longer distances, one of these cartridges is sure to elevate your game. I'd love to hear from you. Have you tried any of these cartridges, or is there another round you swear by for long-range shooting? Let me know in the comments below. Let's get a conversation going. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell to stay updated on all things precision shooting. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.